Six Reasons to Leave a Narcissistic Friendship by Vivian Bricker Leaving a friendship is hard for any of us. Sometimes friendships end because of life situations or they simply drift apart. There are also times when friendships have to end because one friend hurt the other beyond repair. In the case of being friends with a narcissist, there are many reasons to leave the friendship. Nowhere in the Bible does God command us to remain in a narcissistic friendship. Here are six reasons why you should leave a narcissistic friendship. 1. They don't care about you. I'm not completely sure why narcissists want to be a part of friendships in the first place since they don't tend to care about anyone. However, it is quite often that we find ourselves stuck in a friendship with a narcissist. Narcissists don't really care about anyone, including those they claim are their friends. In truth, narcissists don't have any real friends because they aren't real friends themselves. You don't need to stay in a friendship with a narcissist because they don't care about you. Since they don't care about you, they are going to be more prone to hurt you. God doesn't want you to be in a friendship with someone who doesn't care about you. He wants you to be surrounded by people who genuinely love and care about you. A narcissistic friendship will not be able to provide you with the love, care, and support you deserve. 2. They are self-centered. Since your friend is a narcissist, he or she will always put themselves first and they will always have to be the center of attention. In addition to this, they will always have to have everything be about them. Maybe you have a graduation coming up and you're graduating with honors. Your narcissist friend will somehow make the entire graduation and celebration about themselves. In this way, we can see how frustrating it is being in a narcissistic friendship. It is best not to get into one of these friendships. However, since you are reading this article, you are probably already stuck in one. You don't have to stay in a friendship with someone who is self-centered and never looks after your interests. In order to have a friend, you have to be a friend. And a narcissist individual will not be able to be a good friend to you. They are professionals at taking but never willing to give. It's a one-sided relationship where you always get the short end of the stick. 3. They have hurt you purposefully. Friends can hurt us at times, but they don't purposely try to hurt us, cut us deep, or tear us down. We all mess up and slip up sometimes, but we never purposely try to hurt our friends. Narcissistic friendships, however, are bred with hurt feelings, and in a way, the narcissist can keep the other friend in an abusive friendship if they can convince you that you are the problem and deserve the way they speak to you or treat you. They will abuse your kindness and cause you issues along the road. Not to mention that being hurt by someone you considered a friend could cause lasting damage on your own well-being. Life's too short to surround yourself with a narcissistic friendship. Instead, invest your time in making new friends who will value you as an individual and will prioritize your friendship. 4. They make fun of you. Being made fun of is terrible. As someone who has been made fun of throughout my life, it's not fun. A simple mean taunt or smart remark can cause lasting damage to someone's heart. Mean words can hurt from bullies, but they hurt even more when they are inflicted by people we thought were our friends. Unfortunately, narcissists masquerade themselves as our friends only to make fun of us and tear us down, which, in turn, makes them feel better about themselves. You deserve to have good friends who build you up in the Lord. It is easy to feel guilty for leaving a friendship, but you don't need to feel anything negative. You are making a smart move by leaving the narcissistic friendship and choosing to move on. Move on to friends who will support you and build you up in the Lord. These are friends who will stick around and be true friends to you. 5. They damage your mental health. Our mental health needs to be protected. A key way to do this is by looking at who we are interacting with. If we are stuck in a narcissistic friendship, it will cause damage to our mental health. Since narcissists tend to be cruel, rude, and manipulative, they can cause a multitude of problems. It's likely that you already have some mental and emotional damage because of the narcissistic friendship you are in. Leave the friendship and move on to new friends. You might want to seek out therapy and get help from a professional, 
A therapist will be able to help you work through the trauma and get to feeling better again. There are good friends out there. They are just hard to find when dealing with a narcissist. Six, they will only continue to hurt you. You might think it is okay to sit it out and see how things go, but you shouldn't. It will be a sad, damaging waste of time. You see, it might be hard to hear, but the narcissist in your life will only continue to hurt you and abuse your kindness. They will only change if they want to. Don't waste your life waiting for them to change. Life is more than being hurt, used, and manipulated by a fake friend. Narcissistic friendships are terrible, and they are something you need to leave as fast as possible once you find yourself in one. There is no point in staying in a narcissistic friendship because they will continue to hurt your feelings and make you feel bad about yourself. God desires for you to have a life full of friends who truly care about and love you. You will never find this in a narcissistic individual, but you can find it elsewhere. You can find true friends in a neighbor, a family member, or meeting someone new at a coffee shop. Don't allow your bad experience with a narcissist to cause you to block everyone out. There are amazing people out there who will treat you the way God wants you to be treated. They can be hard to find, yet God will help you and lead you to the right friends.